Well, the IB allocates one hour to do this, but let's see what we can do in five minutes. This is copyright the IB. I can't paste it from their syllabus. Let me add some details to these reaction pathways. So don't forget that's polymer, polyethene, polypropene. That there is the decolorization reaction. The one at the top there is the one with ultraviolet, initiation, propagation, termination. Hydrogenation with a nickel catalyst. Again, that one is with the ultraviolet initiation, propagation, termination. That's your SN1, SN2 business. One, two, three, bang. These are oxidation with acidified dichromate solution. It goes from orange to green. You have to heat it. That one's adding HBr. And that one's adding water, sulfuric acid catalyst. The IB likes that one, alkene to alcohol, because it's easy to do another step after that. Well, that's a lot to learn, making me a little bit sad. But more often than not, the IB will start off with the alkene in the middle, because that's the nice one to do two steps from. OK, let me walk you through some of these with specific examples. Let's start off with ethene. Don't forget you have to draw the hydrogens. You can polymerize it to make polyethene. Don't forget the square brackets, the repeating unit based on the monomer. The N just there and the lines have got to go outside of those square brackets. Polyethene, not polyethane. It's named after the monomer. Okay, halogenation. That makes 1,2-dibromoethane, not 1,1. One, one. It must be 1,2. Those bromines are big. They have to be on different carbons. Adding hydrogen and a halogen gives me bromoethane. That transition with the orange arrow is bromination, and that's the one with UV initiation, propagation, termination. Making the alcohol, well that's SM1, SN2, all of that business with aqueous hydroxide. And now we have ethanol, ethanol and ethanoic acid. The IB loves that as well. So oxidation and more oxidation. And I can fit in ethane at the top there. And with that space there, I can continue to brominate this thing using the ultraviolet light method. That's messy. Let's look at some specific examples. The first one we'll look at is from the IB syllabus itself. Butuene to butanone. So turn the alkene to an alcohol. That's adding water and sulfuric acid. And got to heat that up. And then butan to all, two steps here. The maximum we can ask you to do is two steps. We'll oxidize that to make butan 2 own. It's a secondary alcohol, turns to a ketone. All right, let's see what else we have. Ethane to ethanol. Well, alkane, that can only be halogenated. Ultraviolet light, all of that business. Initiation, termination, propagation, that's the mechanism. And then that's SN2, where you substitute a chlorine for an OH using aqueous hydroxide. Not sure of the conditions? Just put warm. The IB will give you the point. 
And finally, 2-bromopropane to propanone. Well, propanone should tip you off. You need to make a secondary alcohol somewhere. Okay, there's our secondary alcohol. Is that SN1? Is that SN2? You don't know. It's a secondary haloalkane. You can't tell. And finally, oxidation with acidified dichromate, orange to green. Easy. 